Now let's get into the actual War Games matches and starting out with the men, we have Team Brawlin' Brutes, uh, Sheamus, uh, I'm going to call him Pete Dunn because I don't care, Pete Dunn, Ridge Holland, Drew McIntyre, and uh, KO facing the Bloodline. Another L we ate, <laughs> not, not Braun Strowman, sorry guys, <laughs> so confident too. Thank yeah, I would like I would like Ron. That's, that's too much. That's too much, man. There's there's enough man in this match already. Well, all the rumors were KO had me. knee issues. Yeah, that's true. What a shock! Meltzer was oh, wrong surprise, again. Surprise! Surprise! Scoop, scoop, surprise! Shoot. Surprise! Surprise! So, <laughs> yeah, this is this is probably main eventing. Um, legit. This is obviously this is going to be a wild. There were a lot of alumnus of War Games matches in here, especially on Sheamus' side. Um, yeah, Pete. And no, Kevin. No. Oh, Rich? KO. No. Yeah, yeah, KO. That's wasn't it, Rich that's in it. the one with Pat Rich McAfee? Rich Holland was in the one with Pat McAfee, I believe, yes. Okay, so I lied. So, okay, yeah. right, I take it back. Uh, but I'm surprised Sheamus is front and center, not Drew McIntyre. I mean, it is. It's it, it, Boston. Is, it, is, it is his faction, though, so that makes more sense. It's also Boston. Okay, no, you're <laughs> it's right. Boston. Yeah, Basically they're gonna, Ireland. They're going to they're gonna pop him. It's also it's, it's the Irish yeah. side of Boston. <laughs> so, like, the, the, I'm pretty sure the arena's in the Irish yeah. side of Boston. So they have to. Yeah, they're gonna come out to dropkick nice. Murphy's just for just do it. Just yo, moving up to Boston so would be awesome. nuts. Night for the brood. <laughs> it sounds like that Boston. dance song. That would be. That song just be. I guess it's because I'm Irish, but that song just does something to me. It does. <laughs> something to me. <laughs> I love the dropkick. It does. Boston. It does nothing yeah, like to I, me. I was one of the only white kids in my high school who wasn't Irish. Thought that one's sick. Yeah, that sucks, doesn't it? Um. Drink and drink. See, I don't know how this match, this match is going to be wild because of, as of right now, there's only like six matches on this card, so this is going for a very, very long time. Fine, fine um, with me. When you think of the two War Games matches, it's going to be at 45 to 45 yeah, to an hour each. So we're just going to yeah. go around the horn here, starting with uh, Mr. Fretz. Fretz, who do you have winning here and why? I think this this match will have uh, the Brawling Brute side win. I think maybe KO pins Sammy, and then you plant some sort of thing with Sammy and the bloodline starting to uh, dissolve. At least that's where I think it Ooh. should go. Will. Sammy costs the bloodline, and then they're saying, you know, this isn't very oozy, <laughs> and eventually you lead to him get, getting ousted, although I still think Sammy Zayn should be the one to dethrone Roman Reigns. Stop it right I, now. I think this is going to lead. No. The Usos are going to You had me that you had me you had me frets and then you just you speak in blasphemy <laughs> now. You don't you don't have a title in of almost a thousand days get beaten by a joke gimmick. I use that joke gimmick as a compliment to Sami Zayn. Although okay. he's not he's not, what? A, he's, not a, he's not a he's not a title oh, worthy gimmick. He's not not a main although, event title worthy gimmick. Sammy Although a little bit of a devil's advocate, a lot of Roman Reigns' stuff has been very cinematic, especially his 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 wins, his big wins have been very cinematic in nature, and they play up a lot of a story in and of it. And what a better poetic thing than to have somebody from the inside in his inner circle be the one to screw him over and make him lose his title. I don't know if that person's Sammy. But it's an interesting it's an interesting story that you can f fiddle with. But I don't think you set it up here. But Will, who is your pick? I I did like Fritz's booking with the because uh, I think KO Sami Zayn like run it back oh, at WrestleMania. Yeah. Let's actually do it right this do it do it right this time. Um, I think is intriguing, but you know, Roman must pose. <laughs> Roman wins. Roman always Mix wins. Murphy. I also agree that I think the bloodline is going to win at Survivor Series, but I want to see KO and Sammy like truly have a true like good mania match because I'm selfish and I need it. <laughs> but I think it's I think it's too early to it's still a little too early for me to set up Sammy and the bloodline's relationship like deteriorating. Hmm. I think you just need just a little bit more time. Especially because Sammy keeps breaking character and making them break. Yeah. And it's just so good. <laughs> Royal Rumble, that's where it goes. Usi is, I being, agree. Usi is being run to the ground a little bit, 
but it's still it still works. Listen, they have multiple shirts of Usi and all of that out right now. So as long as it's making money, they're still gonna go with it. I think here. There's there's still money on the table. Exactly, there's still money on the table. And here here's here's my thing about that being money on the table. Um, there's still money in Roman Reigns. There's clearly still money in Roman Reigns. Um, but if there is a match where Roman Reigns can quote unquote suffer a loss and have it not be his fault and not even get pinned and still kind of count for lose, yeah. it's war games. This is it, the this match is where he yeah. could actually yeah. lose. Are we gonna go that route? I don't really know with that um especially because number one if you've ever seen Sheamus as the underdog just look at his clash at the castle match he's fantastic as a believable underdog yeah. uh you know yeah. against the mighty mighty bloodline but I do think there is a story here where someone could almost cost or cost the bloodline the victory it could be Sammy it could be Jay um surprisingly it might even be jimmy but i think there is something to be said where you start to see the cracks in the bloodline which leads to something at the royal rumble and then the bloodline completely fractures by by wrestlemania hollywood um which i think is probably going to be the story there but i think you start seeing the cracks around here somewhere who does it i don't know and is it enough for them to lose the match again i'm not sure but my gut is telling me you're having Roman in a main event match. He's the biggest draw in your company. He's the reason that people are tuning in for the most part. And I don't think you have him lose in this. So I'm going to, from a logical standpoint, go with the bloodline. But there are, something's going to, they're almost going to screw up in this. 